Okay, how we doing? Let's check again. What do we have? Remove a card, obtain a common relic, transform two cards. Who's all gold? Let's probably remove a card. I think we needed some boss relics is what I think we need to do. We dodged all the bosses that time. And I don't actually think that's right. I think it leaves you weak versus, excuse me, dodged all the elites. I think it leaves you a little bit weak versus the bosses. This is one, two, three. I can get three campfires. Can I get four and two anywhere? I don't, I don't think I can. Oh wait, one, two, three. That's four and one. Hmm. Ah, mm -hmm. uh, thanks. Ip, Ip can and skill. I P K and skill. All right. Um. I think we're gonna move up through this way. Look for the at least. This way, we get a merchant. Welcome we get back. four. Let's remove the Your parasite. Your loyalty is greatly appreciated. And let's jump up this way. Okay. Welcome back, Orberry. Thanks for the resub. Yeah. Let's bash into a strike. Into... 19. I can't kill him at 19. I can take six and kill him at uh, 10 though. All right. True Grit, Anger, Intimidate. Well, these are shit. That's not that good till it's upgraded, but it's actually decent. True Grit could be pretty good here. Yeah, I'm not thrilled about the randomness of Transform and I don't want to give up the gold and the option was literally like give up my gold and therefore have to keep parasite and get two random cards or just remove the parasite and keep my gold which seems like ah oh, much better i don't think anger decks are a thing dude like i see you guys getting excited about it but i'm not really sure why yeah all right battle here <laughs> options All right, um, don't think very much of that card. This card is bad, so it's drop kick or nothing. I'm okay with the drop kick. It's not a super good card. The vulnerability is good. We're gonna get stuck into upgrading our bash again. I hate upgrading bashes. It's not, it's such, bash is such a bad card, but vulnerability is such a powerful effect. It's clunky, but I can understand it. I can understand the drop kick joy. But nice to get a relic this game. Or another relic, anyways. Alright. Heal or remove a card? Remove a card. What are we removing? Defend. Okay. Strike would have been fine, too. Might have been better. We did pick up two attack cards. All right, this is 16. We can just kill him outright. It's the best way to uh, maintain health. Okay. Ooh, early evolve can be really strong. Can't explain the choice of moving a defend. Um, yeah, I picked up a 
True Grit. So I picked up an armor card to make up for the fact you generally want a rough split in the early game. Like that split is about what you want to maintain because you don't want hands with no defense abilities and no hands with no attack abilities. Um, we, I did pick up an attack card as well, but it's kind of a cycle card more than it is a real attack card. So it's a thought process for me anyways. But you guys are wanting seeing red, huh? Well, it's a good card. Don't get me wrong. Really close. Ended up with Evolve, though. Receive a Golden Idol. Trigger a Trap. Alright. Not super thrilled about that. Let's Smith the Evolve. Card is worthless without it. Doesn't have very good synergy with unupgraded, uh, what's it called, either. Alright. Battle starts. 18. You unreasonable fucks. Not a lot I can do about that. This is such a hard fight. Taking 12, can't do anything about it. Such a hard fight. Burnt the wound out. It's, it's reverse synergy. It's not what we wanted at all. Are you going to kill us? You're looking like you want to kill us. Yeah. I think I might have made that mistake with that strike, huh? Looks like we're camping soon. Pretty painful. Pretty painful. Not loving these cards either. Ah, oh, run's looking terrible at the moment. Okay. I like the game as much as Darkest Dungeon. I'm having a lot of fun with it and putting a lot of time into it, which generally means pretty good things about it. You guys want a random Infernal Blade right now? Is there some reason for that? Sure, we'll take a random Infernal Blade. Sounds fun. A random unupgraded Infernal Blade. It's okay when it's upgraded. It's kind of shit unupgraded, but whatever. It's fine. We'll take it. Take it and be super excited. I was going to fight a boss, but we can't right now. Uh, let's smith the true grit. Carry on. I knew it. I actually, in my head, I'm just literally thinking, man, when it's, when it's campfire, uh, relic campfire, I guess I really should decide if I want to rest first. Oh, well, anyways, doesn't matter. Two more this way. We have to rest before we fight a boss. We can avoid a boss. But we're pretty low on HP. And our deck upgrades are not very strong right now. We really would like a bash upgrade here. You want me to lift? Okay, we'll lift. We're going to die at the first boss, just so we're not... In case anyone's not 100% clear on that. Oh my goodness, yes. It's like a regen potion. Too bad I can't afford that feed. That would be amazing. Uh, it's 117 for these two. Can't do that. Um, what's the boss? Slime. Alright. Okay. Really hoping this wasn't something nasty like this. 12 to us.
All right. Take damage this round, annoyingly. Anyway, I do it, in fact. Although I could take two and hope for a buff cycle out of them. This way, I'm taking four. Second Ancient Potion. I almost used the first Ancient Potion. These decks cards have no no synergy with their deck. We're just going to skip them. Alright. Uh, I say that. There is something to be said about a Heavy Blade again with Gerja, I guess. But I think it's even worse than it was last time. See what you guys have to say. If you want it, we'll take it. I'm not very excited about it right now. Our deck is lacking survivability more than anything else. And I already am having trouble finding the mana to bash. Yeah, I agree. It's way worse than last time. Agreed 100%. We have less ability to uh, lift and uh, left less uh, less in flames. It's much worse than it was last time. I, I don't like Heavy Blade particularly as a card. I mean, it's fun to play around with, but I don't think it's very good. That's going to do another 8 on top of that. It's 25. 25 is 34. We can't one-shot him, so do what we can. Need more defense here. Any thoughts to program a bot to roll those percentages rather than picking the highest? Uh, I don't know anything about programming whatsoever, my friend. So, wrong person to ask about that. To do a little bit more damage. This thing needs to die. It's getting out of hand. This is not the cards we need to draw here. This is bad news. Alright, um, we need some armor. We need some armor very badly right now. I think this is getting pretty close to a wipe here. All right, 88, 80 plus percent. All right, we'll just take that. Oh God, we're dead. This has to be a whirlwind, an upgraded whirlwind of extra mana. Good start, actually. Can't survive, though. If I armor, I take... Uh, what is this? This is 14. Then I take 9, I'm dead. So I have to kill. I can't kill with 1 mana. Even with the strength potion. So we're just dead here. Rip! Oh, rip, indeed. No good. No good. Killed on our way up. Fucking slimes. That's the hardest uh, level one, or uh, map one uh, enemy there. Okay, let's get back to, at the very least, let's get back to the uh, the boss. 
Uh, we avoid the ugly whale because we don't have anything. Um, we want to get rid of Parasite, which means we need to come up through there. I'd like some boss fights too. Alright, let's go this way. Take six, heal six. So do what, eight next time, ten next time, ten next time. All right. We draw three, it's fine. Okay, ancient potion. Um, take a shockwave. I'm not even gonna pretend this one is uh, chat giraffe right now. I mean, you guys are welcome to vote, but. I'm probably going to just be doing whatever we need to do here. I'm going to get weakness here, which is super annoying. Means it takes two attacks to kill that. I want to get at least back to the spot where we have the option of some relics. 8 and 9 is 17, he's at 18. Alright, we'll snap pick Iron Wave there. Uh, we're going up this way, right? Merchant for card removal and seeing red sounds fine. Let's get rid of Parasite. Grab seeing red. Nice. Let's move on. Oddly smooth stone is great. Let's move on. Okay. Too bad both my bones in the opening hand versus him. This damage is annoying. Six block. Turn that off temporarily if you guys want. If it's irritating you that I'm uh, skipping past it. But I want to um, start the run a little bit stronger. I'm getting frustrated with the early stuff again. Alright. Let's go ahead and shockwave into a double defend. Looks good. Can we kill? Yes. Okay. Full health. Nice. That's a skip. All right, upgrade time. Yep. Let's smith our iron wave. Keep that block going. Let's take a boss fight. Knobs a little bit of pain. Let's rig it in our favor. Got a bash in the opening hand. That's nice. And I'll see in red for the double strike. Okay. Um, all right, I don't want to take a million damage, but I don't have an option. Okay, getting full advantage out of the bash. It's hitting me hard again. 14 leaves him at uh, 11. What is this room to move? I think it's actually better to play this. Maybe even that with the block, but this is okay. Anchor, not bad, not bad. Snap pick that metallicize, super strong card. Let's go smith, uh, smithing any of these or that would be okay. Can we get another boss here? If we get another boss, can get another boss. I would like another boss. All right, we're gonna smith metallicize then. Some nice synergies at nine. Relic wise is a magic flower, that's great. 
This run's looking a lot better already. We go to another merchant to pick up the boss, and it doesn't cost us a fireplace to do so. Alright. What do you got for me? You got any healing? I don't have healing, but you do have a another seeing red. We don't have any card draw right now. Alright. Take your next seeing red. Let's move on. We'll smith here. I'll smith the shockwave. And the boss fight. Okay, the egg. This is the scariest of the boss fights right now. Don't need this hand. Alright. Okay, good opening. Okay. 15 damage, kind of annoying. I'm probably going to artifact his uh, opener too, so I don't take the strength reduction. Oh, it takes the armor one first. Okay. Let's look at this. So that's 100% happening. He's got 27. He's still boned. Um, these are doing 7. I think I want the damage. I think I take 5 extra this round. And next round, I might be able to kill him. Oh, he didn't draw it, though. We will draw 15 damage, so if I do 5 to him, he'll die. Alright, so we'll take 4. Oh, of course, I could have just blocked all of it because I forgot it was fucking buff round. Alright. Dreamcatcher and a regen potion. Regen potion makes that worthwhile. The Dreamcatcher is pretty weak. Uh, uppercut right now sounds indifferent. I already have a shockwave. It's a nice attack card, but I think a second Iron Wave is better. Alright, let's smith our Iron Wave. I should turn that off temporarily, chat, since I'm not really letting you do that at the moment. Sorry. Find some potions. Fuck yeah. Energy potion and a block potion. Sounds good. Uh, we're at 54 going in to fight what? Uh, the shape-shifting boss. Smith the Bash. Smith the Seeing Red. Heal? I don't really want to heal. I think it's a waste right now. No armor card is the only issue we have at the moment. We have um, Smith the Seeing Red. We have uh, Metallicize to make up for that. Nice opener. All right. Can't do 34 damage, right? Or can I? 12, 22, 33, I need 34, right? Is that right? I need 30, I need 32. And then I have 33, is that what I had? 12, uh, 21, 30. 12 plus 9 is 21 plus 10 is 31, 32. Heals fucking bad. All right. Okay. 
Do I have two upgraded iron waves? I do, okay. Next one's a decent attack, 12 here. No more weakness, unfortunately. Would have been nice. All right, damage wise, great. I have 20 armor, let's just hit him again. Triple strike. Bash does 12. That's actually pretty valuable. All right. I want the mana this turn. It's 10. Take one out of that. I think that's okay. I prefer the 9 damage. Take a little bit more damage, unfortunately, from that. Okay, he's at 20 here. Let's run block potion here. No card draw. A little bit unfortunate that hand. Okay, should still be able to pop this though. It's eight, no more bones. Only three mana. That's 15. This is 14, okay, we can do it. All right. Okay, this is a turn for seeing red. I Oh, is it? I need to get a bash on him. I don't want him to go into the next phase again. But I'm going to take some serious damage if I run this. This is 10. Each of these cost me 3. So I'll take 9 damage. But I can probably kill him next round. Alright. 16, we can just block these. Can I do 17 damage with this next hand? That's 14, that's 20, that's 7, uh, 13 is 19. And 3 of these is 18. So yeah, I can just armor this one. Okay. Uh, Reaper, Impervious, Dark Embrace. We don't have any plus strength gain. Uh, we don't have any... We do have two cards that auto-exhaust. Three cards that auto-exhaust. There's something to be said about Reaper. Impervious is kind of whatever. Um, I would probably... Do this. Probably take Reaper. Alright. Alright. Uh, Sozu. Damn, I wish I'd used that regen potion now. I wasn't really expecting to run into that. We could could run Pandora's Box. We have a lot of mana. Getting rid of all up unupgraded strikes and defense would be hilarious. We can lose the run right there, though. But we have armor cards that are not that already. Fuck that. Let's go Pandora's for some interesting stuff. Alright. Battle Trance, Sentinel, Wild Strike, Thunderclap, Blood for Blood, Whirlwind, Rage, Clash, Twin Strike. Not the strongest pick, but the most fun. 
All right, 128 gold. It's not really enough for a merchant. Let's take a look around where we're going with this. Could dodge bosses in through here, hit the merchant, go up that way. That looks pretty good. So come down through here, down through there, down through there. Four point whirlwind here. That could so weird all of a sudden. So what is this up to? Potentially up to five. Still doesn't do shit till it's upgraded. Oh, I can't clash because of wound. Fuck. And Reaper heals me for nothing here. It's really not what I wanted to see here. Forgot totally about the wound screwing that up. That's when I played. That's why I played the seeing red at all was to get it out of hand so I could do that. Um. Oh, wrong order. Inflame. Pretty good for inflame. Pretty good for inflame. Pretty good for inflame. Good for inflame. All right, inflame it is. Let's take a look. Get jaxed. We're at nine heal per round plus reaper. I think it's time to get jaxed. All right. Let's shockwave. Seeing red, jaxed. And this is 20, and this is 15, but more bone. I think five rounds of bone is enough. And I probably want to take some potions in this fight. Is it going to cost me five rounds to kill him? I don't think it's going to take me five rounds to kill him. doing 10 can knock that up five six we could do 60 damage right now be nice Good. Uh, corruption. What type of skills did we put in here? We got corrupting skills already. I'd love to get that out of my deck. That benefits from corruption. Don't exactly have a lot of skills though. A bit worried about real armor gain. Currently our armor gain consists of uh, iron waves and metallicize.
All right, we're gonna have some fun with this deck. All right, Jax. Thunderclap. Into a bash. Okay. So Talisize. Into a clash. Wish I'd looked at that number a little bit more clearly. Wasted damage there. Oops. Let's draw. What's corruption? We will rage into a seeing red, into a shockwave. Into a twin strike and a wild strike. Taking a bunch of damage. Not much I can do about that, though. Taking 11. Alright, let's exhaust that. This makes it 5 7s. Which are not enough. It's only 35. He's at 42. So this is 35, five sevens. If I go down to, if I, I goes up to 10, 10 threes is 30. That's 40, sets him up for next round. He's not dead this round again. Sure. So close. Okay. I wanna Reaper him. All right, heals for days. Havoc versus Armament. Sure, let's upgrade Havoc for shits and giggles. Choose one of 20 cards or heal for 14. Let's choose a card. Second Inflame, second Metallicize, third Seeing Red. Feel no pain up there. Let's take second metallicize. We need to smith. Let's grab a upgraded whirlwind, I think. Upgraded corruption would be nice too, but I think I need upgraded whirlwinds. All right. Ah, lose 25 HP, get wrecked, okay? Such a nasty one. 